What's up, family? Welcome back to my black people. You know what time it is now. You see the beard? The look. It's a little dry. That's because it is. If you haven't seen my last video on the Clara B's beard kit, check that out. Hit that card or the link in the description. It's a great kit. And we're on to new things. So you guys know I do roughly three to four beard kits a year, mainly because I like for the beard kit to have time to actually really work, you know, with our hair texture and our hair type. We can't just use a product daily and just say, oh, it's, it instantly does this, it instantly does that. We actually have to give it time and use it for a considerable amount of time so it can do what it needs to do. And we really see it take hold and take effect and really, you know, if it's a good product or not. Now, certain products I've used, I instantly knew within a couple of days, this ain't gonna work. But with the Claire B's product, it was really dope. It was really, really dope. But we got something new. Now, this product, well, you need to see it, right? See if he's out the way. All right, family. Enter House of Classic Cuts. So, House of Classic Cuts, they have a challenge out right now. It's a pretty bold challenge. They have the 90 day challenge. They're like 90 days. Give us 90 days with our products. You will see a significant change in your beard. And y'all know how I do. We're going to put that to the test. This picture right here is actually the thickest my beard has ever been prior to 2021. This picture right here. This is like the fullest my beard has ever been. I've never really quite got back to that length per se. My beard is kind of taking on a, a, a weird shape, a different shape where it has like this little you know, chamfer, if you will, where it goes into the chin. I want that to kind of round out, per se. And also, it kind of tufts a little bit right at the cheekbone, at the also at the start of the jawline coming in from the ears. It, it kind of tufts out a little bit. I don't like that, per se, either. I like for it to be more rounded and full-looking. So we're going to see if House of Classic Cuts can pull that off. So first, what we have in the kit we got the beard and face wash, which I'm starting to notice that now a lot of companies are actually doing a beard and face wash. You know, you got Devil that does it, Clara Bees, they do it, have some classic cuts. They have a beard and face wash, and I think that's actually pretty dope. You get it, you know, to wash your face and your beard. So you can clean the pores um, on your face, get that, get all that grimy and oiliness off, and also get it on, uh, get the same thing for your beard because you still have skin underneath your beard. That's where it grows from. So you have the House of Class Cuts Beard and Face Wash, exfoliates, hydrates, and purifies. You also have the House of Classic Cuts, their beard odor. <laughs> you also have the House of Classic Cuts Beard Butter, Shea Butter, Coconut Oil, and Essential Oil. So uh, the coconut oil is a good fat. So I'm already digging this. I think I know, I think this is part of the magic. The scent profile is black mango in here. It doesn't say a scent profile per se in the Face wash, but it has bergamot, which I love, lavender, sage, and chamomile cedarwood. Oh, let's see what that like. Real quick, we're gonna back, we're gonna backtrack a little bit. And this is like a foaming pump. Oh, that smells good. Oh, that smells good, good. Yeah, man. Okay. I think that's class cooks. I see you. Sim profile game on point, bro. Okay. We also, uh, last but not least, we have the beard conditioner. Uh, detangles and moisturizes. So, in this one, is it, it says just fragrance. It smells good. It smells very light. So, it smells like, let's let's smell this real quick and see if, if it's what I'm thinking. Then I think I know what they're doing. Like, so it's kind of solid. If I can see it in there. That's all. It looks like a cap, doesn't it? <laughs> That's not a cap. So, so I know this is going to be weird. Oh, I see what they did. Okay. The layering of the scent. So, these two are going to magnify each other. So, of course, we're going to read the instructions, make sure we're doing it right. But we're going to put this to the test. And we're actually probably going to do a three-part series. We've got the unboxing, which is the first part. 
we're going to do the 45 day mark. Now, today is May the 2nd of 2021 when I start this. So 45 days from now, we'll do drop the second video. We'll do the video, second video, then drop it afterward. Then 45 days from then, we'll drop the last video and we'll see the final results. We'll take the picture. We'll have all the pictures from way back when, the ones I showed you earlier. And at the end of nine days, we'll see if House of Classic Cuts lives up to its own height. So family, ain't nothing else left to say, but challenge accepted. Let's go. Peace. And I say.